Hi everybody, welcome to part 8 of A Revolution of Light and Love. Beautiful channel teachings from Jesus that show you how to find joy, peace and love by living as your true self. So before we start today, just let's close our eyes for a little moment. And just tune into the healing energy and the healing light of these words. Just taking some long, slow, deep breaths in. Letting everything go in the out breaths. Letting your body gently soften. Letting your body gently relax. Gently focusing on your heart. Feeling a beautiful sense of peace building in your heart. Taking a moment to let this beautiful feeling of peace go out from your heart and flow through all of you. Feeling the warmth and comfort of this beautiful sense of peace. Now as you sit in this peace, you can keep your eyes closed if you'd like to as you listen. Be a guiding light. If you trust in me, I will never let you down. The way to prove this is to, is to test me and to prove to yourself that what I say is true. I can perform miracles and I will perform miracles when you ask, but you must ask. I can't intervene until you ask for my help. In the Gospels were not all miracles preceded by a request for help. Learn from them. They are not complete, but there is still much to be learned from them. They are not complete because not all can be gleaned and understood by one person. That is why even now I present you with many books written from many different viewpoints. Find the one that is right for you, but know they all lead you back to me. Of course, you do not need a book to find me. You will find me in your heart. But if a book can be a guiding light for you, use it as such. You must all be guiding lights for each other. This is your role. You each have a unique and personal way of being this light, but at heart, this is what you are, and this is what you must strive to be. I have veered away from the word strive before, as it implies effort and struggle. Although struggle is not required, you must retain a focus and stay on your path. You must stop drifting through your days 
saying that some day you will do what you know in your soul you must do. Today is the day. Today is the day to live your life purpose, to get on your path and to make a promise to yourself that you will never again walk away from this path. Today is the day when you must step up and be who you are, be who you know you are in your soul. No longer put your life off until someday. You are needed in service right now. You are needed to shine your light right now. You are needed to live the glorious life you know you came here to live and to live it in faith and trust to show others what is possible. Live the word from today for always. This is how you will find communion with me. This is how you will start to work in perfect harmony as we are meant to. You must step up and embrace your destiny, your true life in spirit. Once you live in spirit, you will never want to live any other way. If you find it difficult at first and fall away from me, ask for my help and I will quickly bring you back. It is that simple. Embrace me and I will embrace you. You will find it difficult to, to accept this much love when you are not used to it. But I will be gentle and only fill you with the love you can handle. But know there is so much more waiting for you as you rise up in energy to meet it. You are the only limit on the love and power that can fill you and fill your life. Do not run from it. For the more love and power you can fill yourself with, the more you have to give to others. My love is limitless and I yearn to give this limitless love to you. Your fear pushes this love away, but ask me to rid you of this fear. Make a promise to yourself that each day you will say to yourself, I release a little more of the fear today. Your unfoldment can be gradual and gentle. Just take a step every day towards me. I long for the day you come running towards me with abandon. But until that day, until you're ready, at least keep stepping towards me. Never step back. Never stop. Let's just... Take a little moment to close our eyes. And to feel the beauty and truth of these lovely divine words. Knowing these are words of divine love. Feeling that love flow through us. Knowing today is the day that we can accept that love. That we can step forward into that love. That we can be that love. My soul guiding me this week on how to live this is a guided meditation you can do with Jesus, which I'll just read out for you now. Shine with the love of Jesus. Now that you are aware of your own beautiful soul light, you can combine with the light of Jesus 
and let his love flow through you. Sit in silence, relax and close your eyes. Ask Jesus to step close to you and guide you. Begin by tuning into your heart and bringing your focus to your soul. See and feel its pure white light shining, gradually expanding and enveloping you. Now see and feel Jesus' love as a golden light burning at the heart of your soul. Feel Jesus' love gradually expanding as the golden light grows and grows until it envelops your whole body. Feel yourself flooded with love as you sit in this cocoon of pure love. Feel your soul light and the love of Jesus wash through each other and know you are one with Jesus. Repeat to yourself, God is love, all is love, I am love. Ask Jesus if there is anything he wants to tell you at this time. When you're ready, gently come back into the room. And in, in this week's live meditation, we'll do that little meditation or a beautiful power of a meditation of combining your light with Jesus' light and becoming one night together. And it is a beautiful and powerful experience. And just reading those words again, there are, I think that idea of being held in the cocoon of love is the best description I can give of connecting as one with Jesus. And it is always that cocoon of love of support, of belief, never anything else. So forget anything you may have felt up to now and know these are ready to hold you in this beautiful cocoon of love. So thank you for listening and until next week, take care.